This isn't exactly what we expected. The Las Vegas Raiders right now are... Well, first of all, they're not playing the defense that I thought they would play, but also, uh, well, especially uh, against the Broncos. Um, But the quarterback situation is the most important. The quarterback situation is the most important position in the NFL. If you have a great team, aside from that, it doesn't matter. It can still hinder you. And I see, or I think we're seeing that to a degree with the Las Vegas Raiders, where... (sighs) Gardner Minshew has been a okay. Um, he hasn't been anything to write home about uh, so far, completing 70% of his passes over 1,000 yards this year so far through five games, uh, four touchdown passes, five interceptions. Um, he hasn't been awful. In fact, we've seen a lot worse. Jamarcus Russell, need I remind you. Um, but at the same time, it's wasting the rest of this team. Devonta Adams wants a trade. That should tell you all you need to know. Where you've got... Arguably your best player on the team right now, or at least one of them, wanting out because of a quarterback situation and the way things are going right now that, I mean, it's not great. Aiden O'Connell isn't starting anymore, and I think he uh, is a little upset about that. But at the same time, it's like Aiden O'Connell hasn't played great either, if we're being honest. Um, Obviously, the pick against the Broncos yesterday, like I would argue that that interception wasn't on him. It hit Brock Bowers right in the hands, and you got to make that catch if you're Brock Bowers. Um, you're also not getting the running game going like the, yesterday against the Broncos. Yeah, she ran for 115 yards, but you had to do it in a couple of different ways. You had to get really creative a couple of weeks ago. Um, but overall, your team is not getting it done in the quarterback position. And it doesn't need to be hard. Like it just doesn't, we don't need a 30 to 40 touchdown, 5,000 yard passing season. We don't. We need to take care of the football. We need to run the ball. And we need to play solid defense. That's all, that's all it is. And we've said it from the very beginning. If Gardner Minshew or Aiden O'Connell can do those things and just not throw interceptions, we'll be fine. But both of them seem to have missed the memo that they're doing the one thing we asked them not to do, and that is throw interceptions. Because you had Gardner Minshew, who was very late, to say the least, on a, what would have been Brock Bauer's second touchdown of the game, uh, I believe it was Brock Bauer's, um, in the red zone, where obviously uh, I think that this was a pick six uh, for the ages uh, for Broncos fans because, I mean, it was thrown right to him. Like, you just, it is what it is. Um, but it's just, we got to see more from this offense. And again, I don't think you have to reinvent the wheel about what you need. I think you need to establish the run and not throw so many turnovers. Um and maybe that's an offensive sort of coordinator type thing. Maybe that's more of a planning thing. Maybe that's more of a coaching thing. I don't know. But overall, this quarterback controversy we have right now, um, it could separate the team in a lot of different ways. Because Aiden O'Connell, I, even though, yes, he threw an interception against the Broncos, it wasn't as bad as the interception that Gardner Minshew threw. I know that's, that's where we're at now, comparing interceptions, right? But in reality, in my opinion, and just looking over this offense for the last couple of weeks as it kind of went through games, Aiden O'Connell has a better way of distributing the football and getting the ball to his playmakers, and he's been playing a lot of garbage time recently because, um, you know, obviously things haven't gone according to plan for the Raiders, but you're in a position where you do have a very good team. You do. You can run the football. You can play solid defense, and, you know, you're coming off last week. You're coming off a win over a, a pretty good team in the Browns, even though now that's looking less and less like the case. Um, but you are still two and three in this thing, and you're still kind of in it. So I think that for the Raiders right now, it needs to turn into we need to figure out this quarterback situation. Whoever you're going to start, roll with them because we don't need this distraction as a team anymore. But also at the same time, we got to run the ball. We got to play solid defense. And that quarterback, whoever it is, I don't care needs to stop throwing interceptions and turning the ball over. That's 90% of the battle. So overall, this is a really long way of me saying I, we got a quarterback controversy. I don't know who should start at this point. Maybe Aiden O'Connell. I think maybe give him a chance um, this week um, going up against the Steelers, even though it's a really good defense. Um, don't know. I think I could see it going both ways. But overall, let us know what you guys think. Who should the Raiders start at quarterback? Make sure you guys like, comment, and subscribe down below, and we'll see you on the next video. Thank you.